Okay. I mean, it could be a dog show. The New York City Ballet could have its own dog show. Do I have a dog? Yeah, I have, I have a dog. I do have a dog. I do have a dog. His name is Pippin. He is the love of my life. My husband and I, we would love a, uh, a boxer. My dog's name is Shadow. Um, he's a Norwich Terrier. We want a brown boxer. We would name her Tina. Um, and... Her name is Viva. She's a Yorkshire Terrier. But to her, a studio is a playground, and she gets very restless. Just doing great. She has her own theme song, and she has taken up attacking flies. She's really a dog's dog and has taken over the couch. I don't have a dog, but I have a cat. <laughs> She's really little, and her name is Cosette. Nobody has cats. Everybody has puppies. Everyone in City Valley has a dog. They're nice to have around, even though I'm allergic to some, but that's OK. It doesn't really matter. <laughs> I'll get over it. Take my inhaler. I'm going to be a dog. You have such an easy life, you little. You'd still have to come to work. Yeah, you do. <laughs> We're a dog company. You don't have to leave them at home. You can bring them into work. They can come to class, rehearsal. Even the ballet masters have dogs, and they bring them into rehearsal. Who, who else gets to take their dog to work? It is amazing to see. Sometimes there can be six dogs in the studio, like during class. Why are dogs so popular here? They make people happy at the end of a hard show, you know, Tuttle Buddy. I think it just like keeps people normal. That's like a normal thing that we can have because we don't have many normal things. When you're having a really terrible day in the studio and you're really doubting yourself and I get home and there's that little face just so unconditionally loving. She, she makes my day. They're companions and they make you feel good and I think maybe because our job is so strenuous it's nice to kind of look at your dog and just everything just goes away. I went to the pet store I was like I just need some company. <laughs> There's something so comforting about having somebody there always you know they're just happy to see you. I think that's why most people get dogs. <laughs> we'll be back. Oh, shit.